Hey guys, it's Gadamu here, and uh, this is the review of my Dom Cannon final version. Um, Dom Cannon, custom MSIA, um, a friend of mine, Sentinel Gundam, very good skills he has, painted it for me. Um, there's an earlier review of this before it was painted, so uh, yeah, he uh, made me a custom weapon as well, right here. That he custom painted. Pretty cool weapon. First off, I gotta say I like I like this pose. My backpack just came off. There we go. I like this pose. Looks like he could fire this, fire his missiles, and then cut them in half if he wanted to. I like that pose quite a bit. Anyways, um, this is a model kit gun right here that he painted for me. Very nice job. The uh, backpack is a modified Zaku Cannon backpack. It's got a little modded part here for holding the sword. Uh, filled in those holes. Cannon's modified. And I just glued a uh, Zaku 2 backpack on there. That way it could cut eject off. Because uh, really, the Dom Cannon is a modified uh, Dom Tropical Test type, basically. I mean, if you look at them, they're almost exactly the same, except for the backpack. Love the missile pods. Nice detail in there. These were uh, Shining Gundam arm guards. I don't even... The shoulders were uh, new Gundam shoulders that got cut. And this is a piece from the uh, Bolt Gundam that was put on there. I used a lot of epoxy putty to fill in the gaps. But uh, you can see with lots of paint, looks real good. The cables came from a uh, goof, and a Dom was Dom version one was used as the base. This is Maxter's chest. You can see uh, a nice detail in there. It's pretty perfect. Really like the color scheme that he chose. Sentinel Gundam did. Um, painted the hands for me too. Whoops. There we go. Um, hands turn 360 degrees, elbow joints, arms go completely around. Arms stay on pretty good too. Head uh, pivots up and down because I embedded a neck in there. Cannon moves up and down. And the uh, backpack can come off. Backpack seems there. There, I got it nice and tight now. I really like uh, the silver Xuan sheet um, accents they put onto it. Feet look great. I have to uh, put the boosters back on under there because I sent only one to him and he had to put two in. These came from GPO2, um, the back thrusters, and these came from the front skirt armors of uh, Bolt Gundam. Took two Bolt Gundams to do that. You can see. Nice detail there. Just, just a cool, cool figure. Um, so, thank you, Sentinel Gundam, very, very much for custom painting my MSAA for me. And uh, guys, you're gonna see this guy in Gundam Father a piece at some point in time. Rest assured of that. This guy will be in Gundam Father a piece. My stop motion animation. Gundam series I make using the MSA. Well, if you're looking for Gundam MSA, so you can make your own customs, etc., or just collect them, make sure to check out our store, Gundam RS, your favorite arm sealer. And there's a link down below in the more info area, and we get new stuff all the time, and uh, we get cool accessories for Gundams as well. Catch you guys later.